It's sailing time. Birthday boys going sailing. pontoon after the freaking dog. That's Bam Bam! That's Bam Bam! <laughs> Asshole! Bad dog. Start the engines! Bam Bam, does Love Off sound good to you? Keep your mouth shut while I do this. What's with the stupid hat today? <laughs> shut up. Wait until they get a grip of your stupid hat. Oh, wait. We're off to the island of Lobos which is so cold because the Spanish is 
Well, I'm assuming that Lobos is Spanish for lion. Sea lion, because when it was first settled in the 19th century, um, it was populated by a big population. <laughs> by a lot of sea lions, basically, but uh, candles and sandwiches saw the back of those. And uh, now there's just people on it. Very sad, really. Ooh. Your first birthday sale, dear? First ever. Not a bad way to spend your birthday. <laughs> Tell me, what is a fact about sailing that everybody else thinks is the opposite? That you have to be rich to do it. I think we've proven otherwise. We're pretty bloody poor. <laughs> I mean, we're not poor. We're rich in adventure. We're rich in adventure and life, love, happiness, hangovers. It doesn't seem to be very exhilarating sailing today, though. So, one of my things that I would say is a myth, is that sailing is crazy, you've got to be mad to do it because it's dangerous and it's high octane. It's not quite so high octane today. Not, not today, it's not, no. <laughs> I can recall a time though, <laughs> not so long ago, <laughs> that was fairly high octane. I mean, when you're talking about going well, three miles an hour, there's very little that can go too drastically wrong. Correct. But when you consider that the fastest we ever went is 10 miles an hour, we <laughs> were both <laughs> in fear of our lives. <laughs> there's not a big difference between 3 and 10 in the, great, in the great scheme of things, is there? There is in sailing to me. There is in sailing, yes, absolutely. What's on the menu for today's sale then, babe? Spicy parsnip soup. Nummies. And some bread. Mmm, <laughs> nummies. Let's get it in there. Mm, that's delicious. We're really quite far away from Lanzarote now, aren't we? furthest we've been away from Lanzarote since we plummet got here. <laughs> it's quite an interesting landscape seeing it from this angle. It's all, it kind of dips where Playa Blanca is. Playa Blanca goes around so much further, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Infestation. An infestation of what? Humanity. <laughs>
Today we've come to have a look at the volcano on the island of Lobos. And we're almost, let's say, level with the lighthouse on the island. And the, the volcano is directly in front of us. It's quite impressive, isn't it? The swell's coming in from the west, well, the northwest. And it's just bashing against the side of this island. And you can hear it from here, so I wonder how it's still here, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> We can just see clear water between Lobos and Fuerteventura. I think we can turn around now. But next time we'll be here, hopefully, we'll be able to anchor. Yeah, hopefully. There's a beautiful lagoon on the south side of the island, apparently. It's a bit far for us to go today to get back before dark, so we're going to leave that for when we're anchoring. By all counts, it's, uh, it's pretty beautiful. So yeah, have a look at this volcano. Lighthouse. So originally the lighthouse on the island was lit with paraffin, uh, which came from the sea lions. Uh, then it was used, uh, they used kerosene, um, which meant that the, the light could be seen from further out into the ocean. And now it uses solar power. So Leaps and bounds, leaps and bounds. <laughs> Ready about? Alright, Captain! Helm to Lee! Yee ho! Taking us. Okay, you go the other side, I'll wind us in. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, we'll turn around the other way. Just get a bit of speed <laughs> up first. Going around in circles. <laughs> there we go. At least we got some traction in the water this time. <laughs> We refuse to put the engine on. Refuse, I say. I've actually had to put the engine on because there's no more wind. <laughs> it seems to be the dish of the day every time we go out bloody sailing for a day. Not a breath of it. We've got both the sails out, but there's no solid wind. So engine. Weather though, it's got to be about 25 degrees. Look, I've got me leather out and everything. I'm in my birthday suit. <laughs> leather and I am. Passenger ferries just come into port over there. Great guns. Now we've got to deal with this. Hang on to your beer. <laughs> Here we go, it's coming. It's coming, Boris. Oh no, such big waves. <laughs> Whatever shall we do? <laughs> Sorry, love, but if they're not six meters, I'm not bothered. Whatever. Ollie's seen much worse than this. Goodness, we're moving around a lot. <laughs> my oh my. Oh, do you mind? That's brilliant. You see how the swells bounced off Ollie and is now moving that way. <laughs> That's physics for you. 
not a cloud in the sky. Except the big black diesel one made by the passenger ferry. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, give us a like and subscribe. Help us make more videos like this by joining our Patreon family.